when my wife was murdered, I realized that in order to make the streets safe, I had to get just as dirty as those animals. Wait. We are doing God's work. What up, what up? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Old IJ. This is the first video I'm recording after coming back from spending my birthday out in Brazil. And we got power coming up this week the final episodes and of course you just seen that teaser of what don carter has a store and it already looks like he's about to be wreaking havoc he might be one of the most corrupt officers we've seen in the power universe so i'm expecting for these last five episodes to go out with a bang but before we jump into this and we break down this little clip of don carter if you like power content breakdowns theories and predictions after show discussions you're at the right spot I'm Mode IJ. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. We're on the road to 50,000 subscribers. And man, I think we're going to reach it by the end of September. So let's go ahead and jump into it. This is Don Carter, the last episodes of Ghost, season four. The first time we were introduced to Don Carter, we seen him in the church and he was praying. And now we're hearing him voice over talking about, I realized once my wife had passed that he needed to clean up the streets and get out there. And we already established all of that. And he has Monet, he has Drew, and he also could potentially get Diana to come over there and work for him. Now, he doesn't care where you sell your drugs to as long as civilians aren't involved and he gets his cut. You know, whenever a police officer wants their cut, they're going to be on you and they're going to want you to work 10 times harder than you already were because this is extra money in his pocket. But now it looks like he's playing a little shady game. And it looks like Drew might end up being locked up. But this might be a play that Don has in store. People been asking where has Kamal Tate been? Well, it looks like he's back. And this looks like they're about to pull a raid. Now, this might be a raid on the bar. Or this could be a raid over on to what Zion has going on. Maybe they're on to Noma's trail. We know that Kamal has been the one trying to get Tariq to flip. But Don doesn't want him involved in it. Now, I know people have been speculating maybe Kamal, he's going to be on alive this season. I don't know. But we do know that Don Carter is applying that pressure. And if he wants the job done, he'll get it done. You see how he maneuvers with all of his personnel. He tells them, do this, make sure this is happening. Keep Kamal off the trail. We'll handle that. That's because he wants his cut. But there's going to be a lot of drama. And there's going to be a lot of action in going into this last part. This is the finale. I'm expecting episode six for us to just pick up straight into the action. Bang, bang, get them all. There's also a clip where we see Don talking to some white guy. And then you see him planting a gun on him. Now, this is the second time this season we've seen a gun being planted. Remember, Junior, they had the gun planted on him. Tariq had to go in there and do the quote unquote saving. Well, Don Carter is pulling the same trick and he's making it work. He shoots the gun at the door to make it seem like they shot at him when he entered in and he placed a gun on him. So he's probably calling it in. Hey, the perp is down. He fired off his shots, had a fire back. This is making him look good. And it's probably also a drug bust. And if it isn't, he'll probably either stage some drugs or what I could see him doing is stealing some drugs and giving it to his people, Monet and Drew. Because at this point, they don't really have any suppliers. They're trying to get back in good with Noma. As I mentioned, we will see Drew going to jail. Here he is. And of course, in the second half trailer, we've seen him fighting for his life, trying to get out of there. Now, I don't know if this is a play from Don Carter to get in there to start moving drugs on the inside because it's very lucrative. You would think that people in prison don't have money. But for some reason, they make a lot more on drugs on the inside than you would on a hand to hand in the street just because of the markup and the risk of getting it in there. So maybe that's what Drew is being arrested for. Maybe they told Monet, no, we got to put Drew in there. We got to make some money in the prison because y'all ain't making no money on the street. We could tie in to Don Carter stealing the drugs from old boy, planting the gun, and then giving these drugs to them to take inside the prison and for Monet to probably sell out of the bar. That doesn't make any money. We also see Don Carter going up into the house. Now he pulls a gun out on Diana and he also puts one gun on Monet. Now this must be him trying to extort information from Diana. Cause remember the only people up under Don Carter at this point that we've seen is Monet and Drew. Diana is still a part of Noma's organization because she's at the school and her and Effie still have their business relationship. 
So he might be pulling the gun on her and saying, Diana, let me know where Noma's operation is, where the drugs are, or I'll shoot Monet. And that's why I'm saying maybe Drew had to go in jail so they could start selling drugs on the inside because they don't have a big connect on the outside. We know Tariq is trying to get back over with Noma, but Monet and Drew stand alone. They don't have any kind of foot in the game. This is going to have Monet feeling a certain type of way. We have to remember Monet is on her mother of the year run right now. She wants her family to be together. And with Don Carter playing them and not having any work in the streets, it's just going to be tough overall. So I wouldn't be surprised if Monet is the one that gets even with Don Carter in the end. That would be something good to see. But then again, this is the finale. So we don't know. Don might go ahead and get rid of Monet for us. And... The Tahada family is already in crumbles. Kane, he's with Noma. He don't know that <laughs> Davis is doing what he's doing. Davis and Tariq, they both been questioned by Don Carter. So it's a huge spider web, and you don't want to get caught in it because this is the finale, and anything goes.